There is a new iPhone coming, and it's going to be announced by Apple in just a couple days on September 9th. And my inside sources, Yahoo.com, uh, tell me that it's going to be released. The 4.7-inch will be released on September 19th. Mm. Don't quote me on that, but that's what they're telling me. Now we can go to the wide shot, because we all have... Are you guys even paying it? Huh? No, We're sorry. on. We're I'm doing sorry. this thing okay. here. I'm just, uh, I just learned that ISIS killed the 5.5. Oh, the, the phone. The phone? Yeah. They, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, so we've all got these things, so we fully admit it. We have three iPhone people here. I've got an iPad, I've got a MacBook, which I knocked a glass of water on this week, and then my blow dried, and which ended up melting the keyboard, but I still have a MacBook. You got a MacBook, I, I know you. I've had Mac since 1984. All right, so you're in I it too. I sign on early. Chad, you have a MacBook or, a, or an Apple? Are you on the PC? What are you I, I am a Mac guy. I've okay. spent millions of dollars on Apple. Apple suppository. Okay, so you have the, the facts. We have all fessed up. Bias. We're in it. We're in Bias. it. We're in it with <laughs> the Apple uh, products. Um, now, I want to show you, there's a couple leaked images of the iPhone 6, so let's just take a look real quick. It's going to be thinner. Oh That's right. Oh it's going to be thinner. So what you're seeing there is the outside back of the case. Uh, let's look at the shot of the casing profile. Oh. Thinner, Ooh. sexy. Wow. Isn't that thing sexy? Look wow. at that thing. Let's look at the bottom. Oh, I just came that, three times. Oh, he looked at the bottom. <laughs> so he's an ass man. We now know he's an, he's an ass, ass man. man. And let's look at the front of the screen. Ooh, and apparently that'll be sapphire glass, which is very hard to break. Mm, yummy. Um, okay, so yeah, apple, apple, blah, blah, blah. We all know it. We kind of love it. We hate it. So that's where I want to start with this thing. Do you guys sort of feel like slaves to Apple? Because that is how I feel. Like when my MacBook broke a couple days ago, I had just been at Apple because my phone, the audio stopped working and I can only use it on speaker. And when I was in there for that, I kept thinking, is this my chance? to get out, but then I was like, ah, I got a MacBook at home. Go? Do I have to, s Samsung, I guess, would oh, be the. Oh, with this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, or that you can go to, right. I don't know, who makes computers now? Did Dell or is Gateway See, 2000? See, that was what I was going to say. So who uh, are you going to go to? Does IBM, is that a company? I mean, I've got a new a a guy who works on my Apples at home, and he used to work for the NSA, and he says, everyone in the government <laughs> has Apples, basically. Right. Everyone, they make them special for the government workers for CIA. Everyone in the world is working on these machines now, so. Is this good or bad? I, I don't, don't know, know what you're telling me. Is I'm just saying that, you know. No, I'm saying that if you want the, the, the best OS, and the most efficient machine, uh, these things tend to do better than the other ones. Now, I know for a fact the, the Samsung people in the comments right now are going to blow up because every time we fine. do something pro Apple, they go, but, but we have this and that and we got the other thing. And, and, it, the and if you have Samsung, bless you and, and have fun with it. And, and it, it does all the same things this does because this invented it. Mm. Uh oh. Wow, she's, uh, yeah, no, I think we should all fear Apple. Yeah. I think Apple is ultimately a George Orwellian uh, nightmare coming. You know, because then it'll be it's coming. It'll, it's already oh. happening. Yeah, it's, yeah, no, it's no, here. No, we, no but the product. You know, we keep hearing like the product in the pipeline. We got ten years of product. You know what? Let me tell everybody something. Steve Jobs is dead. Okay. <laughs> all right. Time to move on, people. Until I start seeing an eye liver and an eye eye and an eye ear and an eye and an eye uh, colon. Click. You know. Eyeballs. That's what's going to happen. Is Apple do all that with no balls joke? <laughs> well, I did a clip. I'm trying to keep it clean. Clint, the eye clip. Yeah. You know, everything is gonna eventually. My balls went right over your clitoris. Apple will be the new ISIS. That's my prediction. Wow. Apple, Apple will take over. I don't even know what that means. It means that you know you're going to be loving this corporation that eventually becomes so powerful it becomes a nation state. So, so, so haven't they become everything that they fought against? Because the, the George Orwell reference. I mean, they did that. There. Don't they we did always? that. Well, they of course. We, I mean, that's that's how we do it. That's life. Edge, right? edge, ed. Mainstream culture takes the edge, it simulates it, and makes it the mainstream. Yeah. I mean, that's what happens. But it's worse. It's worse because, and we've talked about this, you're going to be so locked into something like Apple that at a certain point, you can't get out. You can't get out. Right. So it's like the mafia. You yeah. can get in, but you can't, you can't get, get out. out. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Uh, so, so you have to do small things to resist it, like uh, my let my big computer die. I had it for six years, which is unheard of in yeah. Apple time. Yeah. I mean, my dad was an early adopter. He had, uh, my dad you know, did docu you know, documents and email on his computer. He had the towers with all the computing. You, know, you, could, you could go to the, the moon and back with this tower. Uh, every year he got a new one when the new one came out. I don't do that. I resist, I resist, I resist. I've had a crack in my screen Fight the power, for sister. over a year. Uh, no, not getting a new one, not getting it fixed. Screw yeah. you. I'm walking around with a crack. I'm okay with my yeah. crack. Yeah, that's the novice. That I already have somebody waiting in line for that 5.5 iPhone. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You know why? Because I was cursed with, Andre, get close over this, Andre the Giant size thumbs. <laughs> yes. So doing this on this device, I want to, you know what, if they don't release that 5.5, I want to tell you, I'm driving up to Cupertino, 
and I am punching that guy in the dick. Why are you saying it's going to be three sizes? That's my understanding. You heard three? Yeah, I haven't heard three sizes. No, it's two person. sizes, and if it's not a 5.5, somebody's getting a dick punch. It's, it's big. It's Just for the big. visual, we should note that you have a smart car, which is one of those tiny little cars, so if you were to get the five point, I mean, that your phone would be bigger than your car. My phone rides shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't have to call it, just put it right there. You want to put a seatbelt on it. Um, all right, last thought on Apple. Uh, so you know they're building this giant fortress in Cupertino. Yes. Yeah. So an image it's just came out. bigger than the Pentagon. The bigger than the Pentagon. It, it sort of looks like the Pentagon, although not, it's not round. shaped. Huh? It's round, but it's got like that feeling of a fortress. Oh, so prophetic. to your point, oh. yeah, so fortress. Are the, when is, I mean, really, Apple has attack. more money than the U.S. government. Yeah. They have liquid assets, and they are just churning out money, money, money. Yes. Um, when will companies truly uh, surpass the government. I mean, have they already? Like, Completely. They've, 100%. They've already, yeah. Yeah. Who, who, yeah. What, who's the gentleman, the Eric Cantor this week? Oh, Where did yeah. he go? He yeah, went Charles, to Wall Street. Um, yeah. yeah. Uh, no, there's no, uh, government is uh, is not this biggest thing at all. Uh, big business uh, has way more power. And uh, I, I like, I think it'll be fun. The Apple Fortress will be fun. It'll be like a Hunger Games kind of a thing, maybe. You know, they'll have like fun things in the middle and people be killing each other for yeah, like, iPads. Like, like I Thunderdome. I Thunderdome. Yeah. It's all yeah. a dystopian future and we just have to play along, which is why, yes, I talk about this all the time, but I probably will get it because I don't want to fall behind in whatever the future may hold. Enjoy falling behind, people. I'll Enjoy. finally win the thumb war. <laughs> I can't wait. That'll be 5. it. 5.5.